Okay. Here's the bike. In a warehouse with his brothers, going to get shipped off to Bogota, Colombia, hopefully in the next day or so. Well, I'm at the airport in Panama, waiting for my plane for Bogota to take off. So, this is it, my last day in Central America. What a trip it's been! Brilliant. too sure what's going on but I heard some announcement the crowd went nuts looks like a plane is here or a plane a plane has just pulled up I have got no idea what's going on Latin America well about three hours late I should have been in Bogota about an hour and a quarter ago an hour and 20 minutes ago Here's a plane, be thankful for small mercies, that's what I say. Hopefully it'll be all plain sailing from here. <laughs> Town Bogota. Look at this here. Painting graffiti on churches. My goodness, I've never seen that before. That's pretty bad, I think. Is nothing sacred? Seems to be market day in Bogota. I'm heading off to Montserrat. That's a funicular railway up to the top of the mountain. It's a very open air city, Bogota. There's little sort of tiendery shops, stalls all over the place. Well, what that's all about. There it is there. The actually there's two of them, there's a cable car and a funicular railway. At least I think that's what it is. So it looks like it. Getting closer. I tell you, I need a funicular railway to get up this blooming hill. Bogotá's at 2,600 meters, I believe, which is almost as high as the north rim of the Grand Canyon for reference it's higher than the south rim but almost there the view from Montserrat be quite spectacular if it wasn't for the conditions how many times have I said that on this trip pretty cold up here I'll tell you that much
3,170 metres above sea level. Thought I was a bit tired. What's that? That's close to two miles high, isn't it? And there in the mist is the figure of Christ looking over Bogota. these pedestrian only areas it's really nice particularly for me because I like to walk around heading into Plaza Bolivar right now the main square in Bogota It's starting to rain. Impeccable timing, Tony. It's a great place, Bogotá. Though. It's cheap. I just had a kebab, uh, a beef kebab with a potato, medium-sized potato, a dollar. Sort of late lunch, I guess. I saw it, it just looked really good, and I thought, no, I'm not passing that up. So, I'm good, I'm good at least until tonight for a dollar for me lunch. Not bad at all. Wow, impressive cathedral. structure.
there in the distance is Montserrat, where I just came from. This, apparently, is a chop suey. Doesn't look like any chop suey I've ever eaten before. Looks like chips and a mound of, well, I don't know. Looks pretty good though. Three and a half dollars. Can't be bad. Little restaurant in a side street in Bogota. Next day. And here is the Plaza Bolivar from the cathedral side. Really quite nice. It's actually warm. All the little areas in Bogota seem to have their own designated business sections. I just passed through an optical section where there's hundreds of opticians and glasses places and the moto section where all the motorbike stuff was. Very handy for me. I'm going to go back there as soon as I get my motorbike. And this seems to be the flower section. Very nice. I'm a couple of blocks south of Plaza Bolivar and it looks like the sort of city centre is giving way here to the suburbs. But you can see on the other side of the road, as far as the eye can see, all on flea merchants. Really quite interesting. <laughs> <laughs> 